Okay, guys. We haven't done this in a while. It's Yoda Joe 93. We got a fucking rant to do tonight, okay? So, if you guys were excited for Wakanda Forever, you can still be excited for Wakanda Forever. Don't get me wrong. But Marvel has done the same bullshit again to us. It wasn't bad enough that they had to take Ghost Rider away from Multiverse of Madness. It wasn't bad enough that we didn't get to see Deadpool in Multiverse of Madness. They cut something once again. It wasn't bad bad enough that they cut things from like they cut things from Multiverse of Madness. They're cutting things from pretty much everything. It's ridiculous. And now they've done the one hope that I had for for, for Wakanda Forever. We knew we were excited to I I, I don't agree with, I'm not saying the movies going to be bad. I think the movie could still be good. And hopefully the characters are still good. And there's still things, reasons I'm excited for the movie. But one of the things I've spent fucking four weeks on making theory videos for you guys. Is I'm so excited for Doctor Doom to be introduced to Wakanda Forever. Because we got the concept art. And they set up him being a part of this. This is fucking bullshit man. I'm so pissed off about this. They have reportedly cut Doctor Doom's cameo. There was no actor chosen. They said they scrapped it months ago. But why this is bullshit if you go back to an, to the first Avengers movie, they teased Thanos without having to even show the actor for Doc, for for Thanos. We just got an actor that looked like Thanos, and then they got the real actor in Guardians of the Galaxy. So why couldn't we get treated the same way with Doom? Why couldn't they just put the man in the suit, and then we find out the actor afterwards? This is complete nonsense. And also, the thing is bullshit is in 2022... The last comic book movie to finish off the year is Wakanda Forever. So the official best cameo in any end credits scene now will go down being Superman. Which is not a bad thing, but it's just really stupid that we can't get Doctor Doom. And I know people, I've seen people online like, you can't have Kang and Doom follow up each other, that'd be too much hype. No, they would be perfect hype because they're both going to be villains on different fronts and it's important for Marvel to get their shit together. And I think they can handle this. Honestly, guys, I'm pissed as fuck about this shit. Let me know your guys' thoughts. And I hope you guys have a great day.